check this out. The Magic Kingdom is closing today at 4.30. Insane. Today is a super rare day inside the Magic Kingdom with it closing at 4.30. It is a ghost town in there. The big question I have is what in the world is going on with Walt Disney World today at the Magic Kingdom? I think I have an answer. This is a sight that you rarely see here at the Magic Kingdom. Midday, nobody is here. Nobody is here. And on first thought, I thought there was a Magic Kingdom buyout. Technically, there is, in a way. But look at this. Look at this. I love coming to Magic Kingdom on days like this. And wait till you see the wait times. Remember when we did our coast to coast challenge, it was a huge line for photo pass. Not today. And also today when you guys um, see this video, this is like gonna be the one of the last times we see photo pass costume as it is. They're actually getting a new costume. It's gonna be green. They're gonna be way easier to spot, but it's also environmentally friendly. So I think those costumes are all going away. Quick little scan here at the front gate. Unbelievable. Let's head on in here. And uh, I did hear a Festival of Fantasy just started. But um, yeah, look at this, 4.30. Can anybody guess why that is? Holy camoli. Usually there's a lot of people lined up for the parade. Nobody, nobody. And here's a quick look at the wait times today. Right now as of 12.30, it's a Festival of Fantasy day. Look, at, unbelievable. Nobody. Absolutely nobody. Look at this cast member having a ball. They're leaving friends. Somebody fans. What a day. Give this girl an entertainment contract. Come on. I love it. What an amazing day. Now today, I want to focus on rides, rides, rides. So we're going to get started right now. But first, let me tell you guys why Magic Kingdom is like this today. How's it going, Roy? Never get to see this empty. Everybody lined up for the parade. It's only one family deep. Usually it's like, woo! Not today. I believe the longest wait time is 60 minutes and it's Pan. Leave it to Peter Pan. Today I looked at my, my experience and I saw like the low posted wait time. And like I said, I instantly thought that it was a, a Magic Kingdom buyout, but it's not that today. Here inside the Magic Kingdom, I believe is the first service celebration of cast members today. So they technically is a buyout, but it's a Walt Disney World buyout of Walt Disney World. If you don't know what that is, it's when casts, are, casts have been here for five, 10, 15, 20, and beyond years, every five year increments. They get a whole park to themselves with unlimited food, alcohol, and this is every cast member here at Walt Disney World who has hit that milestone. And they usually do this on times of the year where it's not so busy, and that's today. My time working for Disney World, I personally never got to experience this, so I don't really know what they all entail. I did work one once at the Haunted Mansion, and we had a lot of code, what was it called? Code Vs, because you know, there's alcohol here in the Magic Kingdom, and those sometimes happen when alcohol is combined. Code V is a uh, code for, you know, use your imagination, but we're gonna head on over into Adventureland and try to get as many rides as possible today. We have about four hours left. And I'm telling you, if you can luckily be here on one of these days, do not avoid the Magic Kingdom. 
get a park hopper ticket, stay here, you can get the whole park done. Watch how many rides we're gonna get on today. It's truly one of the best times to visit Walt Disney World. When special events like buyouts happen. Say it with me right now, it's a walk-on. Because everything is. You betcha we're gonna go on Jungle Cruise. I hardly ever go on this one because it's always like a 60 minute wait. 25 today. Sure enough, there it is. I don't know why people have purchased Lightning Lane today. Not needed at all. We should have gone to Mine Train first. It's only 35 minutes. That's because of the parade, I'm guessing. No need to even use half the queue today. There's our boat name, Irrawaddy Irma. Seated on those back pockets for the entire time, but looking at the spiders in. Rule number two, no eating or drinking. Rule number four, don't make me sad. Rule number three. Now, let's do a little bit of a boat orientation before we get underwater. Underway. Sorry, underwater was my last boat, but that's all beneath us. Behind well, this is us. Beautiful. <laughs> Sorry, bit of a Freudian slip. You know when you say one thing and you meet a brother? Another. Sorry. Look up. That's the top of the boat. Look down. That is the bottom of the boat. Should at any point during today's journey these switch? Well, <laughs> on an unrelated here, what is all this rockness? Oh, that's cute. Look at that. That monkey's holding a gun. That monkey's holding a gun. Okay, look your left. Look your left. Don't look at him. Don't look at him. Nile, the water goes on for Niles, in Niles, in Niles, and if you don't believe me, well, that means you're in disbelief, yeah. On your left, you'll see an African boa. I'd like to ask you for Austin, how did you land your job in the Jungle Cruise? And you know, I think it's really plain to see. So I took a crash course. You know, I've kind of just been winging it ever since. I'm going to scare off this hippo like I scared off my last relationship, don't worry. Well, it looks like we've now entered an Indian elephant baby hole. Does anyone know how you can tell these are Indian elephants? We're in Cambodia, pay attention. Oh, fun fact about elephants, actually. Did you know elephants have one of the best memories in the jungle? I wish I had a memory like that. You know, it really helped me my job. On to our next ride. That one only took about 20 minutes. It's all about being quick today. And I feel like being quick is what I do best. Pirates is a posted 10 minute wait. Say it with me. It's a walk on. Looks like they're still refurbishing outside over there. Unreal day. Let's go. Holy camoli sauce. I love the Disney parks like this. I hardly turn around and film the queue where we come from. No lightning lane today. Hey, how's it going? We walked on this ride, baby. Well, I just rode with Caitlin. She found me here in the parks. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Absolutely. Say hi to my future self. <laughs> hi, future self. <laughs> on to the next. Real quick, as we head on over to uh, Big Thunder, let's see if there's any updates at Splash. I did see a crane coming from uh, the monorail over, and I do want to try to get the pennies. Thunder is a 10 minute wait, by the way. 10 minutes. Sure enough, there's the crane. It's behind the mountain, so it's not really obstructing any views, at least from up close. 
like I said, I did see it on the monorail. I want to go on Thunder first. It's a 10 minute wait. And then we'll head towards Splash to see if we can find those pressed pennies. That'd be awesome if they bring it back. 10 minute wait, guys. Comment down below what would you guys do to be here? There's proof. Proof right there. Say it with me, everybody. It's a walk on. Doesn't get any better than this. Oh, there's the crane. I guess you kind of can't see. It looks like they're working on the queue first. Got a different viewpoint from Splash Mountain. I can see the work lights on. You guys can't though. Days like this are just incredible. Been on three of the most, you know, high wait time rides in the like last two weeks. That would have taken probably like two hours. Head on over to Splash real quick. Here's a quick, quick look of the wait times. Everything is a walk on. Let's see if we can find the press pennies. Sure enough, they're actually right here. I think they are the Splash Mountain ones too. So here's a look at all of them that are available. <clears throat> Obviously, we want the Splash Mountain ones. That's why we're mainly here. It's uh, four dollars. You, you gotta work for it, but pretty cool that they still brought this back. Ooh. One. Two. Three. Four. We're done. And just like that, we've got our Splash Mountains pressed pennies. So happy they brought that back. I mean, it's, a, it's so easy for them to make a buck off that. Four bucks to be exact. A lot of you guys were commenting on my Disneyland video that they were back because Nate went and showed you guys. So that's kind of cool that we finally were able to get that. We had to go to Disneyland to come back to Disney World. But we got them. What a glorious day. Haunted Mansion, I think, is a 13-minute wait. Looks a little bit longer. Let's go check it out. Really love when Haunted Mansion posts a 13-minute wait. Let's see, it looks a little bit longer, but regardless, shouldn't be that long. Shouldn't be bad at all. On a day like today, do not purchase Genie Plus. I'm very advocate for that, but like today it's just such a waste of money. I guess to each his own though, right? Disneyland, they 
still have that hidden Mickey. Wish they would have kept it here. We got stopped here. to the next walk on we go indigo no we go <laughs> i don't know there really is nothing better than a completely empty magic kingdom it's truly truly magical usually we have a lot of people walking through here it's kind of a bottleneck area nothing five minute wait for it's a small oh one up to ten. Oh no not a 10 minute wait hell yeah 60 for Peter Pan. That's probably, I think, the longest in the park. Just kidding, it went down to a 30. Interesting because the app says 60. I wonder what Seven Dwarfs is. It says 40. This is, an, this is a complete no-brainer. I don't think there's really any line at all. It says 40, but I think we just walk up. This is literally... Incredible. Watch how far we're gonna just walk on through Seven Doors Mine Train line. Humpty Dumpty Doo. We're walking and walking and walking and walking and walking and walking and walking. And here's where we stop. I'm gonna time this for you guys. It's really not that bad. Three minutes. Not too snabby. Time to let all the energy out. Hi ho! I wish this was longer. Thirty minutes for mine train, that's a steal. Midday? Today is a glorious, glorious day. Ooh, sorry, I mean, no worries. Wow. So pretty. Just a couple weeks ago, this was deadlocked with people squishing in. Not today. Big beard, Kyle. Hey, how's it going? What's up? A beautiful low pack day. And that's gonna wrap up uh, our video, everybody. Time is about 3.30 here. I could push to go on more rides, but um, we're gonna be doing that challenge coming very soon. Rope dropping is coming back, and maybe even, even reverse rope dropping. It's great. I didn't really rush, like I said I was. So I didn't really need to. I mean, you guys saw the 30 minute wait for mine train. Incredible. Days like this are very hard to come by, but if you're here when one just magically pops up, do it. Do it, do it, do it. The Tomorrowland Terrace appears to be cleared 
for whatever may be going on here tonight with the cast special. You see that? It's not normal. There's like extra lighting, maybe some photo ops. Side note, I do know Maid Street is going to have different photo pass other than green. I think they're gonna have a bow tie, but believe it or not, it's the last time we're gonna see this here in Magic Kingdom. Look at this too. So cool and empty Main Street. I think there's a cavalcade coming too. Unreal. Correction, it's Festival of Fantasy coming. Look at this, no one's lined up. I mean, everyone's in the shade, but no one's over here. An unreal day. Still a ghost town. Still a ghost town. Wow, you can see them laying the foundation here at the new Polynesian Extension Hotel. They're getting really far with this. Holy camoli sauce, look at that. Progress. You can see them setting on up for the service celebration. This is where they'll pick up like their name tags. I actually don't really know what they get, but congrats to all those cast members goes all the way down there it's just like last year every year just got me some nummy fresh kitchen i love fresh kitchen if you guys don't know what it is try it it's supposed to be healthy it's delicious that was it for today's daily vlog i do have a huge announcement coming up i've been hinting at it for a couple videos i'm just making sure before um everything's set in stone so that can be dropping any day um probably in a couple days but um yeah, might be having a trip coming up this weekend. Still kind of finalizing everything, but that was it for you guys' daily dose, and um, I'll see you guys tomorrow.